when I was a kid, I'd ask my dad, Hey, Dad, where are we going? And he would often refer back to me or answer back to me, Well, to hell if we don't change our ways. And I always thought that was kind of funny. But then I started thinking about it, and I was like, wow. So, then why do we go to church? <laughs> and why do we pretend to be somebody? And why do we do all these things if we say to hell if we don't change our ways? If we're aware that we're doing things and participating in ways and behaving and making choices and activities in ways that are going to send us to hell... Why don't we change them? And I think it's because we're not really aware of what those choices are. We just know shit ain't working out. Shit's not lining up. It's not It's not looking pretty. And that's not just because of my perspective. I mean, you can look around the world and see a million things that aren't working out. So, as I grew up, I started questioning that a lot. Because I started saying the same thing. I started saying, well, to hell, if we don't change our ways. My kids would say, hey, mom, hey, mom, hey, mom, where are we going this weekend? And I started finding myself saying that more and more often. The more disgruntled I got and the more unsure, unconfident, or uh, dissatisfied I got with the results of my life and the results of my choices. So I started looking at the way I was doing things and how I was behaving and how I was acting and the habits and beliefs and discipline I had had put into my life and it wasn't quite adding up. I was eating things and doing things that were going to destroy my body by the time I was 40. And so I started looking at these choices and decisions and well, I don't think I'm going to hell anymore. I'm pretty sure of it. I don't believe that. So I've changed my ways.